I had a client who used to train the snipers for the Navy SEALs. Calmest person I ever met in my life. Having a chance to go train with, with all the gentlemen and the special ops on the pararescue jumpers, calmest people I've ever met in my life. And I was like, okay, something's weird. Every single one of these people who are considered elite in what they do are calmer than anyone else I know. Mm-hmm. And I started realizing it was not the ability for them to upregulate into this totally intense, crazy version of themselves that can handle anything. It was their ability to downregulate in times of chaos and stay calm, present, and grounded when all hell's breaking loose around them. And so I look at that and I was like, ah, that's one tool we could probably use just as a group if we're trying to navigate something that feels chaotic. It'd be probably pretty smart, you know, three, four, five times a day to practice five minutes of tactical breathing. There's that 3160 ratio. If you get that into your nervous system, the goal is use it when you don't need it so that in the times that feel chaotic, that's where your body drops back to. I heard a friend on a podcast say, um, under stress and chaos, you drop down to the level of your training. And so if you're regularly and consistently training 3160 in your nervous system, when you get into a position where all of a sudden it's chaos for you, the natural base you'd fall back to is calm and focused, which is what you need in moments like that. Right. Very powerful tool. 